You're watching Hayes' TV and we're here at CBIT 2010 in Hanover. We're over on the G-Skill booth where we found this. This is a G-Skill's Sand Force controller for their SSDs. Um, basically, this is the new Intel chip here. You can see here it's the Intel E8200 um, platform uh, and there's all these other bits and pieces here. But the thing that you want to notice here is uh, look at this crystal mark score here. This is an early sample, so these are just rough benchmarks. But you've got a 20, this is random access as well, so there's 29 and then 73 there for the right as well. And you've got all the little charts there. So if you want to just zoom in on that, Stefan, for a second, and then all the geeks can just pause the video and check out those numbers. And I'll wait. That's long enough for you to be able to press the pause button. Let's go and have a look at some memory over here. And uh, if we just sneak around here, okay, this is the TDS series. Say you want to load a load of memory, yeah? How about 24 gigabytes on one board? So this is an uh, Asus P6 F50, say it again, an Asus P6 X58D premium board, and you're running 24 gig of the T uh, TDS stuff there. Um, have a look at the timings here, DDR3, 1800, and then here's your memory timings here, 8, 9, 8, 24, okay? Um, and that's the available memory there is 22 gigs and if you have a look here you've got the total memory is 24 gig there as well. So that's running on Core i7 920 platform, a P6X58D motherboard from Asus, premium, premium board from Asus. Let's move down a little bit here. This is the PIS series and that's just slotted in there and I've got the little GCL cooler on top. Um, so here we're talking uh, 8 gig of memory there um, and again look at these timings here, 7, 10, 10, 28. Um, and that's DDR3 2208 that you're running there as well, and that's on a Core i7 860. And then finally, over here, we've got um, the Flare series, which is also known as FL, the FL series, but they're calling it Flare. Um, this is it here, it's got that nice little red uh, um, bit on top there, going for the cooler there. And uh, if we just look through here, you've got 8 gig running here, and it's a DDR3 1800, 78724. Got that, Stefan? Everyone's really happy with that. So there you go. Um, large amount of memory. High speeds, that's the sort of stuff that's coming from G-Skill and also Sandforce as well, which is that new memory controller which is still in development and we'll be looking at that actually hitting the market sometime around April, so I'm told. Check out soon on Hastings TV for more from CBIT 2010.